Hey guys, we're back with more Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, and last time, we went through the hell that is Hollow Bastion. But now we're faced with a predicament. Turns out there's another way we can get to Hollow Bastion, because the way through it at this moment has been sealed off. So, at this point, we only have one way to go, and that's through here. Besides, it's the only way for us to even get to Hollow Bastion in the first place. So let's get to it, since by this point I'm gonna have to go full throttle from here. And you're probably wondering why my ship is now faster, stronger, packed more armor and all that junk and everything. Believe me, it's gonna be insane. And there's that portal straight ahead, so let's take it. And here comes the obstacle course. Yup, I'm gonna have to fly through everything. There's so many different enemies around here that's gonna be insane. And hopefully, once I get myself all the gummies from my ship, I can pull out all the stops and create the ultimate ship capable of going through everything. And yeah, there is a lot I have to go through after this, such as the optional bosses, the Hades Cup, etc. I may have to go through it solo in time off screen for one reason to obtain the ultimate weapons, and plus, it takes way too long. I'm not kidding, it does take way too long. And here come the rest of the enemies. These guys aren't even that worth it. They're not even worth it since I now have enough laser power and firepower to wipe them out to oblivion. It's just too good to be true, I'm sure. And more ships show up and I dodge everything. Every single thing. They're not even worth it. I think I may need to upgrade my firepower to add even more powerful laser cannons and such like that. Okay, and yeah, my ship now has a haste too, which means now I can like, reach areas much faster. Not to mention, I have tornado-like wings, which improves my maneuverability. Improves it very greatly too. And this is getting insane. Very insane, because we're dealing with so much opposition. Well, not really. Look at this. My high score is already over 700. It's crazy. And I kind of like that. Nice job, Sith, for providing us the idea that we have to go around in order to penetrate the defenses. Because by this point, the Heartless have multiplied by the masses. They've multiplied a lot. So, we're almost at the end. Time to fly our way through and class what's left. There you go. There we are. We have arrived at Hollow Bastion. Yet again. I can tell this is going to be a tough ride, I can assure you. Yeah, I trained a lot, and now I'm at level 50. I'm not kidding. Let me see if I have Combo Master. Where's Bell? Still in the castle. Still in the castle? Against her will? No. I think she stayed for a reason. The other princesses are inside as well. I wonder why. Let's go ask them. You may need my strength. I'll go with you. And for this point, I'm gonna stick with all my party members because there's some trinities I need to get my hands on. Yeah, since now we have the white trinity, we can now access the rest of the treasures. And I've already gotten almost all of them. All I'm missing is just three Dalmatians and that'll be it. And once I do that, then I'll cover a video where I get every reward possible, including the upgrade to Aero becoming Aeroga. Ah, there's a white trinity here. Let's unlock it. Trinity Union. And yeah, Donald's got himself the, like, the wizard sh relic. And with that, that's gonna really help. Ah, all we get is a Thundaga G, so bleh. That's pretty lousy. Alright, let's head upwards. Since now we have at least more prepared than anything. Look at my AP. Oh yeah, I forgot. Off screen, I got my hands on Lady Luck. And my MP is now at 10. That is big. I'm not kidding. That is big. You're going to see me use my magic a lot here. Since I overuse Strike Raid ray way too much. But there's a reason for that. The reason why I use Strike Raid way too much is because while you're like using the move, you're completely invincible. And it looks like they brought red operas, like red nocturnes. Not to mention, the Heartless have gotten stronger. Which, yeah. Once I have a Rogue with me, then that's gonna be out the window. And since most of them are weak to Blizzard, I can just keep on attacking and attacking. Thanks, Donald. 
Ow! And it falls. Wow. That must have been a blaze shard. Gotta catch up to it. Oh, you know what? Strike Ray. Strike Ray can basically pierce through that. And here come the large bodies. I'll just use Strike Ray. Seems as the only thing that can pierce it. Oh, nuts, I missed. Great, I messed up the Strike Ray. Three, four, five. Let's see what I get here. I get a Spirit Shard and a Shiny Crystal. I'm going to be encountering enemies that are going to provide me Crystal Bells, since we're going to need it for item synthesis. And that should be it. And I got my MP back at six. That's good. Yeah, looks like we're going to be encountering a lot of Heartless in this fight. In these series of fights, I mean. We need to find a way to get up there. Wait a moment. And Heartless have appeared. Large bodies and some wizards. I don't know if Strike Ray is going to be helpful since I chose magic. Things. Doesn't really matter though because it gives me an excuse to use all the MP I have. And I'm about to unleash my judgment. Judgment is bad. Great. Goofy's KO. Two, three, four, five. Yep, I'm completely invincible when Strike Ray is in effect. That's going to be useful for at least a lot of boss fights. And that should take you down. Really. And my air combos are now at 5. Gotta get the item. That gives me a spirit shot. Yeah, and I have to supply, like, grind a lot just to get my hands on this. Very good. Nuts. I gotta check if I got combo master, because if I do, I can use it to take advantage of it. All right, good. Let's see. Abilities. Hurricane. I don't even have Combo Master. What gives? I have most of my other abilities, but I don't have it. I guess I have to train some more. And believe me, the only good skill I'm ever going to need is Strike Ray. Since Strike Ray makes you completely invincible. Not to mention, rather clumsy. Two... Three, four, five. At least I'm stocking up on frost shards. Uh huh. And I guess it has to take those. Gotta keep on using it. Nice. That ought to take care of it. But sadly, I don't have. I don't get a defender shield. Yeah, those defender shields are rare. And I gotta get you out of there because now there are defenders everywhere. Right, I'm in trouble. My comrades are in trouble, but not to worry. Strike Ray will do me wonders. And I have everyone with lucky strikes so I can be able to get rare items easy. Mm -hmm. Three, four, five. That ought to push him back greatly. Nuts. Thanks, Donald. Well, at least now it gives me an excuse to properly train. And hurricane, like ripple drive. One, two, three. Great. Now I'm gonna do this. Nope. Great. Donald's KO. Come on, man. Much better. God, these guys take a lot of punishment. I'm not even kidding. They really do take a lot of punishment. Let's head for the library. Though I know I may have to go somewhere just to make won't get the last treasures, I think. I know Belle should be around here. If she is, then we may get ourselves something really useful. Ah, here we go. Oh! How cute. You've come to seal the keyhole, right? Please be careful. The darkness is raging deep inside. We've been holding it back, but we can't hold out much longer. We'll take care of it. 
Good thing, too, because we're gonna need it. Let's talk to Bell first, before then. This is for you. Use it to face the darkness, as the beast has. And we get Divine Rose. Divine Rose in the original game was a very powerful Keyblade. But in Final Mix, holy crap. Dang, a power of 13. You have no idea how powerful it is that you now have a strong Keyblade at your disposal. Very strong at this late of the game. Originally its power was at 10, but it was changed to 13. But before we do that, we're going to have to go through the lift stop again to get our hands on another treasure. And these lift stops take rather long, made worse by the fact that I actually had the directions change during the three-part Hollow Bastion run I did. Let me tell you, when I was recording Hollow Bastion, it ended at two hours, and I had so much failure against Maleficent. God, she was so annoying to deal with. She wasn't just annoying, she was very annoying. Though I need to find a way to get through there, because it'll help me a lot. Eh. Looks like we'll have to find another way to get up there, and fast. Yeah, these rides take a rather long time. Hope you don't mind getting yourself a drink while you wait. Okay, we've arrived here, now we need to find that chest. Ah, there it is, let's use some Gravira. Time to force it down and see what we got. Let's see what's inside. A Ramu belt? What is that? Let me see. A Ramu belt. Ra reduces lightning damage by 48, 40% and raises max AP. Let's see how much AP I got. Wow, that's a lot. That's a lot of AP, I tell you. That's a lot. Hmm, this can give me some advantage, but for now, I'll equip Ars Arcanum. Since I'm going to need a Keyblade for close quarters combat and everything. And let's go through the ride one more time. I may have to cut this out. Okay, we're back. Man, that was nuts. Time for us to reach even higher through this place. But I can tell we're in for quite a fight. We may as well give this one, Divine Rose, a little test. Though in Japan it's referred to, I think, La Dien Rose. Maybe, but I'm not sure. If you guys know what it was in Japan, please let me know in the comments. And we got Defenders. Defenders and Blue Rhapsodies. And I got a Frost Shark in my jump. You know what? Aurora. And dang, it's a powerful Keyblade. And when I mean powerful, I mean literally it's powerful. It took down the defender like it was nothing. Man, that is sweet. Okay, now let's find our way through here. And well, what do you know? We got a large body. Let's see how our Sarcanum works. Four. Okay, you know what? Our Sarcanum. One, two, three. Three. No, whatever. I just did it. And I got a far shot from the troll. Huh? Who is that? This must be the Shadow Soldier. Crap. I died against that Shadow Soldier. Yeah, I never thought I'd expect a Shadow Soldier to show up. The worst thing about it is that the Shadow Soldier hits fast. Trust me, I had no idea he was going to show up. So, it, this, I think this death was pretty much intentional. Yeah, it was. Okie dokie, let's try this again. These with strike rate is helping me. And I take down some of these harmless with ease. And I missed. Whatever. Three, four. One, two, three, four. Man, I deal a lot of damage this way. I hate it when games like these have to inflict this difficulty on you. 
Alright, now it's time to pull an R Star Cane. Let's go. Two, three, four. Nuts, I messed it up. You know what? I'll just stick to Strike Rate where it's safer. Not to mention, I pull a lot more pain. Alright, defense. I'm gonna need some wind. Come on, there you go. Not to mention, Aroa does some additional damage along the way. Now my MP's raising to 6. And bye bye. And I take this wizard down too. And they brought air soldiers and defenders. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Man, I gotta finish stuff. You know what? When I'm done here, I'm gonna stick to like strike rate for this. Because I'm using strike rate a lot more than also the other ones. I don't know why, but I think they made this one much more reliable than yours. Good thing I dodged that. Goofy's dead. Very good. That should take care of things. Now let's move on. We need to head to the lift stop and head upstairs. Oh boy, this is gonna be tough. And we gotta come great. One, two, three. What? How did I hit? Oh yeah, I forgot. You have no invincibility when you have Ars Arcanum equipped. Yeah, so even if your opponent attacks you from behind, expect to get hit a lot. And I think it's due to the fact that I'm having a little trouble with my Blue Yeti mic. Don't worry, I'm getting the hang of this. Believe me. It's not used to my headset because I have to do it so close, but... Ugh, this is a problem. Hmm, I always want to try Ragnarok, but Ragnarok would be a bit risky. Let's see. Fine, for the time being, I just won't equip anything. I need to save it up. And now, let's try Strike Rage, because at least with Strike Rage, you're completely invincible. Not to mention, you deal considerable amount of damage and unleash your judgment upon your foes. And let's go around. And I can dodge him completely without even any threats. Come on. Miss the ice attack and deliver the pain. Just the way how I like it. Now we need to head for the castle gates. We need to find a way to head up all the way to the top. Hopefully so we can finish this. And we got white ones. You know what? I'll just use Strike Rate for that. Since Strike Rate can take them down to about three hits. Not to mention, deals a lot of damage to them. Here come the air soldiers and everything. There. Wow, that ought to take them down. How did I get hit? I forgot, Leaf Racer is only effective against yourself. And I got a power crystal. And here comes more trouble. Two, three. Now I shall unleash my judgment. You know what? Lizard for your trouble. Oh yeah, I forgot this one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh no, I fall down to my death. That sucks. And I gotta go all the way back up. Doesn't really matter by this point since I actually know what I gotta do. But at least I deal some added hits to these monsters. Yeah, but it's gonna be tough. Very tough. Looks like I'll have to fly through a lot just to avoid everything. Even with the fly rounds. And there's more enemies aplenty. Sorry guys, but I got no time to waste with you. Time to head to the lift stop. These enemies have already been defeated, so I'm not complaining. Makes it easy for me. Though if I had the encounter up, it would be a problem. Though it would be pretty perfect for grinder. Now to use the strike rate on these wyverns. Get a 3 of KO. And I unleash my judgment, taking them down. Yeah, like I already mentioned already, strike rate is considered to be more reliable than any other ability you'll get in the game. Trust me, I know. 
come on. Son of a... There you go. Great, now I gotta deal with them. Alright, free it up. Nice. What did that Great. Nice. Heal up. Gotta hurry it up. There. And now to deal with another round of strike right Nice. That should take care of it. And now to take this upstairs. Oh, what? No! You gotta be kidding me! I fell down again? I... God, I hate dealing with this. And I'm already over 20 minutes in. Yeah, you, you never want to see me complain when I do stuff like this. Looks like I'm going to have to fly through it. If only I had a higher way of jumping, then I could just avoid these enemies entirely. Great, Dominic Goofy IKO. That's terrific. This is what I don't like. I just want to reach all the way up to the end and just get it over with. Yeah, but the reason why it's necessary here is because I want to get this done. Besides, I'm almost at the end of the game anyway. Very good. Now I pass through the lift stop and then I can continue. Ugh, let's just hope I make it before it's too late. Nice. No enemies here. That makes it easy. Alright, let me just add a little cottage for my measure. Good. I'm gonna need it for this. This time, I'm taking you down. Oh. One, two, three, four. There. No, not really. There, there we go. Now I took you down. Now I take care of these wyverns, because they're the bigger threat. Nice, now I've learned sliding dash. I can imagine how the wild that's going to be. Good. How to find that wyvern. Hmm. Yeah, Goofy must still be fighting it. And now you're dead. Alright, now we can head upstairs and continue. Jeez. Man, that was nuts. Normally it would be short, but... Ugh, that sucks. Nice. Rush and strike a distant enemy. That's gonna help, but I gotta be careful with it, though. Alright, now we can take this lift and keep on going. I can tell we're gonna be in for quite a fight. And I got, like, plenty of high potions and everything, so you know what? I'm gonna stock them up. Stock, 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 stock. You know what? I'll just take out two high potions and two ethers. You'll see what I mean later on, believe me. Yeah, I apologize if I was like too far away from the mic because I gotta focus on the game. Waiting for it. Come on, when are you gonna show up, Heartless? Here we go. Now we take the fight to them. I'm too high up. And defense. Take down the chief freaks. Nice, I actually got some out of the blue. And bye bye. Gotta knock him silly. And I get a spirit jam. Now to use strike rate to take the damage. Very good. Now we got an ether, a shiny crystal, and a thunder shard. Though I'll have to like grind an Atlantica for a thunder gem. Come on. When are they going to show up? I'm ready for it. Yeah, the camera's still being a bit finicky. Hang on, let me just move. Alright, almost there. Sorry, I'm being a bit antsy. Because having it die like, it, like twice, one was intentional, the other wasn't. And I blame my carelessness because I used Ars Arcanum. I shouldn't be relying on moves like that. I should instead focus on just 
using skills that would provide me an advantage because this is different unlike in the original Kingdom Hearts. This is Final Mix. And Final Mix is a whole nother case. Alright, let's just take this upstairs. And it looks like we're about to have some company. In the next area, of course. Alright. Let's just head upwards yet again. Alright. Let's just do strike rate right and take down these enemies. Yeah, this is gonna make things way. Alright, fine. I'll just blast these wyverns to kingdom come. They take three hits to take down the strike rate. Right And nice combo. And I got a heal up. Good. And I got a deep freeze. Deep freeze. Nice. You healed up Donald and Green Requiems. How time. How time we encounter these guys. Nice. Good. This should take care of most of the enemies, and I finally get a bright shot. Gotta hurry and heal up fast. Two, three, four, five. And he ran off. There you go. Nice. That should take you down. Looks like I'll have to hit this switch. That really wasn't the switch that I had in mind. But I think it could help. Maybe. No, no, no. That's a bad idea. Gotta go back. I'll take care of these clowns later. Though I wonder what's behind that door anyway. Can't even reach it up there through that high jump. Let me just push it back down the way it should be. Nice. Alright, now let the fight continue, because we're about to have some company. Now let's take him down. Great, my accuracy is starting to suck badly. And I just saw Sliding Dash effective. Sliding Dash is basically just an offensive attack. But it just gives you like an added reach if you want to reach some bad guys. It's going to be perfectly useful for a boss fight later down the road. Gotta take them down. There you go. I get a potion for my troubles, despite the fact these guys are vicious. Very good. Donald levels up and he gets max AP up. Come on. Two, three, four. Come on. Gotcha. Nice. I get a protect chain and a spirit shard. Now we've reached the high tower. And we got defenders to deal with, not to mention providing green records. And I unleash my judgment. Strike rate again. And he heals up too, and that sucks. Now he won't be able to heal at all. And what's this? A Proterra chain. That's not gonna help. At least this'll do. You're also wondering why I'm using Strike Rate at a point where I just basically use it all, all the enemies. You already know why, so I don't need to tell you. And one, two, three, four, five. Fine, I'll just bash it. Up. Nice. I should take care of you and not have to kill you. You'll have Donald and then Goofy. Uh huh. Four. Nice. Goofy leveled up and he got a boost in strength. Hurry. Nice. Got a spirit gem. And Donald dies again. No wonder the game is. You know what? I'll just use this to take you down. And his attack gets stronger than the next. And 
judgment has been declared. Good. But now we have no time to waste. We gotta move. Sorry, guys, but I got no time. I'm heading to the lift stop. Gotta move fast, too. I'll deal with you clowns later. The time we head to the castle chapel. There are the other princesses here. Let's hear what they have to say. Sora, please hurry. Darkness is pouring from the keyhole. It's all we can do just to hold back the darkness. I don't know how long we can manage even that. All right, I'm on my way. We're counting on you, Keyblade Master. In the meantime, we'll do what we can too. This is turning into a very serious situation. We've been waiting for you, Keyblade Master. Where's Ansem? Gone. When the keyhole appeared, darkness poured out of it. It swallowed Ansem and he disappeared. Though Ansem is gone, the flood of darkness hasn't stopped. We're working together to hold it back. I cannot forget the look on his face as the darkness engulfed him. He was smiling. That's rather creepy. But there is nothing more I can do, so let's just continue on. I got a bad feeling about this. Trust me. Sorry, Defender, but I have no time for you. Time we head for the Grand Hall. Come on, hurry it up. Sorry, guys, but no time. And this must be it. Oh, what the hell. I'll take you on. Fine, what the hell. I'll take y'all on. Keep wasting time. His magic is vicious. He's like he just used strike rate and attack from a distance. Gotta hurry. And nice, I got a shiny crystal. That's gonna really help the synthesis purposes. There he is. Nah, he disappeared. Or not. Nice. And they bring these guys. Fine. Strike rate it is. You know what? Strike rate. And they bring back defenders. This cannot be good, but I'll just attack them here from a distance. Or. And finally, I shall unleash my judgment. You know what? You're. Done. Hmm? Oh, good. Heal up. Looks like I had to go encounter all this opposition first before we tackle the big ones. Wow, that had a hurt. Gotta watch out. Where are you? There you are. Nuts, he disappeared. Come on, come on. There he is. There we go. I think the next one's this way. Let's see what this keyblade gets us. We obtain dark matter. You know what? Fine, I'll just take two, three, four. My judgment is not working. Through. Bye. Nice work, Donald. Now let's see what's up here. We may be able to get something if we're lucky. And this keyblade nets us. Oblivion. Let's see what Oblivion's all about. Oblivion possesses colossal power but reduces max MP by one. In a sense, this Keyblade represents Riku and his struggle towards the darkness. And there's one more treasure chest we gotta get. This may probably be the last one we're looking for. And it is. Dalmatians number 62, 61, 62, and 63 have been found. Completed. And we earned the trophy? Top dog. 
You'll see next video the rewards that we receive. Now I gotta use Strike Raid. Three, four, and finally five. Judgment has been unleashed. Now before the big fight, I'm gonna have to heal up. All right, we'll just use a kind for our trouble. Good, we're gonna need it. And we have one last set of opposition, so Strike Raid we go. Three, four, Judgment has been unleashed. I to take down the big. Nice. That ought to take it down. And Donald got KO'd again. Great. Looks like we got large bodies. But I'm not worried. Actually, since I can just deal damage from here. Just as long as I keep the distance. There's two. Three. Four, five. Is that everything? Oh, there's more? Fine. Ah, oh, oh, great. Can't even get a shot. Oh, now I got it. Gotta watch out, though, because this thing is invisible. That means we don't even know how he'll attack. Fine. Defense. Gotta take down that wizard. Nuts, this guy is fast and invisible too. Come on, stop moving around. This must be one of the most exclusive Heartless. Three, four, finally five. Oh, great, I died. Getting killed by an exclusive Heartless certainly is not doing well for my rep, especially since I don't have enough MP. This is not a good thing, especially despite the fact that I have a high amount of power. It's not doing me well. Yeah, the power I have is at 13. <sighs> this is bad. I may have to change my build, like, equipment. Let's see, I'm gonna have to raise up my strength with the Ifrit belt. Fine, let's just take down this boss. Yep. And finally done. And I take you down. So I'll have to get everything all over again. It doesn't really matter by this point because I already got the trophy. Mm -hmm. And it takes care of everything. Nice. And we got a squad of defenders and a wizard. Wow, nice work, Donald. You use gravity really well. Uh, if this gets long, it's gonna have to be a two-parter, I think. Fine. Right. So I have to go through everything first. Right, he disappears again. This is gonna be a Fine. Right. I just have to knock it down. Is that everything? No, Defender. Three, four, good. And I get a Bright Crystal. That's rather nice. Wait, let me get the chest that's here. Yeah, I have to collect all the chests again. All right, let's just keep on moving. And this must be the Oblivion Keyblade. Yep, you never forget. Can't believe I died from that thing. Jeez, god damn. Not to mention it's a shot it's a shot that's very deadly. Alright, good. Now let's get the last ones and get it over with. Alright, now let's tackle the last set of arms here. And I shall release my judgment. And he brings in more enemies. This is gonna be Nice. Three, four, five. Now I'll need more judgment. And judgment has been unleashed. And this one gives us a Proterra shape. Mm -hmm. Four, and finally five. Alright, 
comes to this now. So, let's head through the dark depths. Dang, look at the size of that thing. This is the behemoth. This behemoth is dead. Alright, now we have to concentrate all our attacks and attack this thing. We have to make sure to keep on holding on. Nice, I don't have those balance. All these combos I'm hitting affect me. I wonder if getting here was an ordeal. Now to get out of the way, because it blasts like an area wide effect. Now we have to go back up on top and try again. Yeah. But we also gotta watch out though, because even getting hit by a shockwave does damage. Now uh, keep hitting him as much as possible, but then ultimately he'll fall down and we'll get a free hit. Nice. I gotta get out of the way. That was bad. high as possible. But overall, the fight's really not that hard. You just need to concentrate as much as possible to try to hit Nuts. Good thing Donald's second win is what gives me what I need. And I gotta keep on going. Hey, out of the way. Nice. Thanks, Goofy. Now to finish the job. But I gotta hurry too, because I don't want to get plastic from my troubles. Uh oh. Oh great, another phone call at a time like this? I can't believe it's going at a time for it. And yes, we got max HP for Sora. That should be it. And we learned the Omega Arts. Now let's go and seal that big keyhole! Sora, you did it. What are you guys doing here? We came in Sid's ship. This is our childhood home. We wanted to see it again. It's in worse shape than I feared. It used to be so peaceful. Don't worry. If we defeat Ansem, all should be restored, including your island. Really? But it also means goodbye. Once the worlds are restored, they'll all be separate again. Everyone will go back to where they came from. Then I'll visit you guys with the gummy ship. It's not that simple. Before all this, you didn't know about the other worlds, right? Because every world was isolated. Impassable walls divided them. The Heartless destroyed those walls, but if the worlds return, so will the walls. Which means gummy ships will be useless. So you're saying we'll never... We may never meet again, but we'll never forget each other. No matter where we are, our hearts will bring us together again. Besides, I couldn't forget you even if I wanted to. What's that supposed to mean? Hurry! Come and close the keyhole! Sora, good luck.
Thank you, Sora. I think the darkness has begun to weaken, but I can feel a powerful darkness growing somewhere far away. It's the heart of the darkness. It must be where Ansem went. Then we'll take the gummy ship and deal with both Ansem and the Heartless. A worthy answer, Keyblade Master. We offer this power to aid your battle. We attain the power of fire, and Fira has been upgraded to Fieraga. Sora, your courage can bring back our world. Once the darkness is gone, all should return to its original state. Kairu, we back on the island? Most certainly, and you should be too. I can't go home till I find Riku and the King. And that's it. I apologize if it took longer than it should, but this is what happens when I have to go through everything. It's not pretty. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time, where we begin... Oh, wait. Wait just a second. There is something we need to do. Trust me, I'm not kidding. There is one last thing we need to do here before we say goodbye to this place. There's a tournament being held at the Coliseum. The competition's a lot tougher now, so be careful. That's going to be taken care of next episode. But for now, I have to go back to Hollow Bastion for one simple thing. Getting Curega. Not joking. We need Curega for this, so we're going to drop by at the library. I was about to end the episode here, but I thought, no, wait, not a chance. I got to show them where they can get Curega. Besides, we need Curega and every other spell at max in order for us to conquer the final battle. Not to mention that I'm going to be grinding a lot just to beat it. Ah, there's Aerith, right down here. Let's talk to her. Sora, you should read this. Read what? It's the rest of Anson's report. Maleficent must have collected it. And we obtained Anson's report 2, 4, 6, and 10. Also, we gotta talk to her again. Anson disappeared when this world fell to the darkness. It was believed he died defending people from the Heartless, but Ansem was the one who brought them here. There is more to the story than you know. Ansem waits in darkness, but here's a little light to protect you, Sora. We attain the power of healing, and Kira has been upgraded to Kirega. However, normally in the Kingdom Hearts, original Kingdom Hearts, you would have it be around like 11 reports, and that would be it. But this game... They've added a more reports to this. Believe me, I'm not kidding. And the only re way you can unlock them is by completing the optional stuff. So, that's about it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and a comment. And share this video around. It does mean a lot to me. And I'll see you guys next time when we get started in finishing things up. Starting with some major boredom. Alright, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you next time.